everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Real Time Training. I'm your host, Paul Turner, and so I want to update you a little bit about what we're doing with our youth room here at Fusion here in Birmingham, Alabama. And so uh, last time I left you, I think we were talking about doing uh, the counter here. And so let me show you what this looks like now. <clears throat> Get out of the way. And we'll show you. This counter here, as you can see, we have uh, done a bunch to it. As you remember, it was black. I mean, it was plain. It was... Uh, it wasn't uh, very anything, it was very stripped down. But as you can see here, we went ahead and painted these blocks, these blank blocks all the way through, and uh, went all the way around here. And they're flags of the missionaries that we, that's Speed of Light, that's what we uh, call this. We call this the Missio Day Cafe, which is the mission of God. And all the money that we get here, uh, we go ahead and forward that on to missions. And so as you can go all around here, and we'll go from there, and there you go, all the way around. And we kind of blacked out the bottoms normally where the TVs would go. We put the black there until we can figure out what we want to do with that and put messages in there and things like that. Uh, we've also updated uh, our tables here. These here, if you remember in the last episode, I think we had those in there. and We talked about the fact that we had gotten those from a Applebee's, I think. Uh, we found it on Craigslist. So if you're looking for those free things, uh, this worked out really, really well. Since we got these for free, these tabletops here uh, that we have that we put on here, Kind of back up just a little bit so you can see. Um, the tabletops here we got at, these are three foot tops that we got at Lowe's uh, for $40. So we got two of those. We got one over here, one over here. Uh, then we had one other big one that was a four foot, a four foot table. Uh, and one of the men of our church cut us a perfectly done four foot tabletop. And that works out really well. So that's not, uh, it's not all quite in the areas that it's supposed to be. So don't, uh, don't think that uh, this is how it's all supposed to be set up because it's not. So we're still in work in progress. Let me take you in here, though. I want to show you another little thing that we put together that you can put together for yourself. Um, I asked one of our leaders to do a table for us, and he got creative. And so I want to show you this table right here. If I can get down a little lower and kind of show you where we're at here. Um, this table here is made out of pallets, as you can see down there, and it's made out of pallets, and uh, he basically took three pallets and uh, put them together, I'll kind of show you from the top here, put them together, let's see here, there we go, and we kind of get a view down here, okay, put three pallets together, and I've recently cut them a little bit. But what that did was, is that kind of created just a little, not a, well, maybe an optical illusion or something like that, where there's a lot of space underneath that. And what I did then was come along, let me show you the top here, okay, and we put just a, a piece of plexiglass on there, we, put the, we cut the uh, fabric to, um, to the size, and then we just cut out these funky uh, letters out of fabric, and what we'll do is, is we will uh, wind up putting pictures, in fact, we may do that tonight, um, let some of our students cut that out and all that kind of good stuff. And actually, kind of like when you do with um, uh, matting pictures and things like that. So what we'll do is we'll take the pictures, we'll mat them on there, and put those funky back backgrounds in the, uh, in the back of those pictures and kind of make them pop out a little bit. So um, that's kind of the update. That's where we're at right now in our room. It's uh, constantly moving, so uh, hopefully we'll bring you back another video soon of something else that we've done here. If you have an idea, something you've done in your room, want to offer me some suggestions. I am way open to suggestions, by the way. Um, so if you have a suggestion, leave a comment down below. Don't forget, by the way, to subscribe over this way and get updates on our video channel here um, of what we're doing in our youth room. And there's plenty of other good things that are coming up too, as well as um, some interviews that we've done with authors. Um, you know, uh, That'll Preach uh, is a playlist that we have that has, um, that has just some little tips and tricks for uh, presenting illustrations in your messages. So there's tons of things here that you can get a hold of, so don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for checking out today, and I'm Paul Turner. This is Real Time Training, and we will see you next time.